Hey, it's Sutton Parks, getting ready for the Appalachian Trail 2019. It's January 9th, 2018. Uh, it's been a little while for the update. I hope, I want to thank all of the new subscribers. Thank you so much. Uh, if you have any questions or comments, please leave them and reach out to me and I'll get back uh, to you on them. Uh, a lot of these videos are just training, you know, mentally and physically. And uh, I hope you all had a great Christmas and New Year's and holiday season. But I'm out at Radnor Lake today. Uh, I've been working a lot at the grocery store, working nights, Monday through Friday. And then I have my cleaning business, so I do my cleaning on weekends. <clears throat> I've been able to pay off, you know, several thousand dollars on some back taxes I owe. And my weight now, my weight is down to 210. Last year at this time it was 255, so I'm headed in the right direction. Um, I'm real proud of that uh, so we just that's one reason I sort of like the grocery job because it keeps me moving I walk about five six miles every night and um, so yeah I don't want to quite let go of that and it's you know <clears throat> I get frustrated sometimes <laughs> they don't have enough people I am the overnight dry grocery team there's me and then there's the team lead <laughs> there's a uh, I don't know 11 aisles 12 aisles most stores will have one person for every aisle or one person for every other aisle and they got me <laughs> so I told my boss I always wanted to be the best person on the team the hardest worker and I am because <laughs> that's all you got but uh, you know I get frustrated on the low pay there's another store about 18 miles away that I could probably transfer to and I was thinking about it but it was really just a resentment I was just mad at at my store and if you see the last video I did where I was angry where they're paying a kid a buck fifty more an hour than me and he's about ready to get fired or transferred or you know whatever I mean there's but you know that's out of my control I can't get mad at stuff that's out of my control and I get mad sometimes because we can't get even close to all the work done again that's the reason they don't have any people is they don't pay enough uh, for that area <clears throat> I don't think our store managers are uh, empowered to do it. It's just very bad management. It's Kroger Groceries and I'll tell you they're one of the worst run companies from my end where I'm looking that I've seen and uh, Amazon's gonna whoop them and they deserve it because if you don't you have empty shelves you make less money and then you can't pay your employees and then you have more empty shelves so it's just a cycle and it's an easy fix and uh, you know if they don't want to fix it or can't fix it again it, it shouldn't affect my attitude uh, my attitude is to get off of work at 6 a.m. and come out here to, well, beautiful Radnor Lake, be in the woods a little bit, and, and just do a good job for them. You know, I do appreciate what I got. Um, Nutrition-wise, you know, I mean, that's how I lost the weight, is, I forgot my selfie stick, so I gotta use my hands. Um, you know, working overnights helps with losing the weight, but really I lose weight through proper eating habits, and. Basically, I have chicken in the mornings. I'll have about four eggs with garlic and uh, a spinach mixed up in my Vitamix. And then I have a, a potato that I'll make as a home fry, home fries. And then later on, I'll have maybe, uh, you know, chicken and a protein shake and try to get a big spinach salad or a kale salad. Dessert, I don't eat really cakes and that stuff anymore. I'll have... Uh, yogurt like a yo plate yogurt those yogurts that are a hundred calories or less and I might put some sometimes I'll put some cottage cheese in them so I get some more protein throw uh, walnuts raisins and then you know either a banana blueberries or or strawberries that I get at Costco and it's so good it's so good and it uh, helps me lose weight and it's certainly um, much better for me than cake and ice cream that I used to eat so everything, you know, I probably got, I want to be about 190 pounds, so I'm 210 now. I was able to fit in a 33 waist of jeans, a pair of jeans that I bought at uh, the Goodwill just to, as motivation. I fit in them to the point where you didn't, you wouldn't want to see me in them because I had that muffin top, and but I could do it. So one step at a time. Anyway, I think that's it. Just going to make a quick video and tell you all hi and thank you again for subscribing please leave any questions or comments in the uh, in the in the thing in the place on YouTube and I'm gonna be uh, doing a gear review 
finally real soon and uh, talk about some other things. So thanks again. Y'all have a great day. Bye.